Assalamu alaikum dears, my silk, silk A. This section will provide detailed solution to a rise in pulse table. Remember the rise pulse table can be used to determine the reduced level of points which are taken at stop rod using leveling machine. Before starting the solution, I'll start by drawing the rise in pulse table. This table contains the column of number, backside, interside, foresight, rise in fall, that's why this table is known by rise fall table, and then the RL, and of course remarks. Let me draw some rods like in this palm, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and of course 9. Let's we have taken some readings on leveling stuff, like in this palm. The main purpose of solving this table is to calculate the RL of each point. Remember the peg side is always taken at benchmark, so the first RL must be known. As the RL of first point is known, so we need the RL of all these remaining points from 2 to 9. To calculate the RL of all these points, we need of course the rise and fall of each point. To calculate the rise and fall of each point, we start by subtracting the intersides from peg sides. Like BS minus IS, this will give us the rise and fall. When the subtraction value is positive, it means it's rise. When the subtraction value is negative, it means it's fall. Like 1.123 minus 1.321, this is of course just the fall. I'm not putting the minus value over here, because the column of fall contains all the values having minus. And then we subtract the interside from interside. So 1.321 minus 2.311, this is of course also just a fall. And then interside minus interside, like 2.311 minus 2.001, this is of course just the rise, because the value is just positive, 0 0.110. And lastly, the interside minus foresight, like 2.001 minus 1.355. This is of course also just a rise. Here again we are passing with back side. So back side minus inter side will be rise or fall. Like 1.522 minus 2.311. This is of course just the fall. Here again I'm not putting the sign of minus because the fall column just contain all the videos having minus. And again inter side minus inter side will be rise or fall like 2.311 minus 2.442, this is of course just the pal, 0.131. And again, interside minus interside, like 2.442 minus 1.881 will be just of course the rise, because the video is just positive, 0.561. And lastly, the interside minus foresight will be rise or fall, like 1.881 minus 1.911. This is of course just the PAL, 0 0.110. Here when we have the rise and fall of each point, then the calculation of reduced level for all these remaining points is quite simple and straightforward. Let's say I need just the RL of point 2. Remember, the new RL must be the old RL minus the PAL, or it must be the old RL plus the rise, like the RL minus the PAL will be just of course the new RL, like 100 minus 0 0.198 will be of course 99.802, so 99.802 is just the RL of 0.2, here again the next point is just the PAL, like 99.802 minus 0.790 will be just of course 99.012. So this is just the RL of 0.3. And again, if you see the next point is just the rise. So the new RL must be the old RL plus the rise. Like 99.012 plus 0.110. This is of course 99.122. And so on, do the same for all these remaining points like 99.122 plus 0.446 is of course 99.568. 
and 99.568 minus 0.789 is just of course 98.779. Also, this RL minus 0.131 is of course 98.648. Here again we have the rise. So the old RL plus the rise will be of course 99.209. And again we have the fall. So 99.209 minus 0 0.110 is of course 99.099. Hey, I just forgot in the remarks. The CP or the chain point and this is just the last reading. Now the calculation or the solution of price fall table is done. But I'm not sure if the calculation is okay or not. For this approach, we do little bit check. This is called the calculation check. Remember, there are always two types of calculation check for the rise fall table. One of these two checks must satisfy the calculation. Let me try the first one check. In the first one check, summation of the x height minus summation of both side must be equal to the last RL minus the first RL. Like summation of big side, remember we have only two big sides. To add all these two guys, we get of course 2.645 minus summation of four sides. Four sides are also of course two. So add all these two guys. Must be equal to the last RL. The last RL is just 99.099 minus the first RL is just of course 100. Do some maths will get the calculation like in this form. If you see both sides of the equation are not the same, it means I should apply the second one check. One of these two checks must satisfy the calculation. Let me try the second one. In this calculation check, summation of rises minus summation of pal must be equal to the first RL minus the last RL. Summation of rises is just 1.117 and summation of pal is just 2.018 the first star is 100 minus the last star is 99.099. To some maths, we'll get the calculation like in this palm. Oh, you can see, of course, both sides of the equation are the same. It means the calculation is okay. And this is it. So, here in this section, we learned how to solve the rise fall table to obtain the reduced level of each point. And then we learned how to check the calculation if it's okay or not. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time and wassalam.